This is a toy camera. No, it's not. This is actually the my first camera Insta We, a kid friendly instant camera that has four main functions. So it can capture photos, that's one. Videos, that's the second one. It's a label maker, the third one. And last but not least, it's a thermal printer that can be connected to your smartphone. So today we're going to find out what this camera can do. So first, this camera comes with a 12 megapixel lens. Uh, you have one huge lens here and another one here. So you can actually take selfie with this camera. And it comes with a 1500 mAh battery, um, but there's no fast charging or whatever. So you kind of need, I think, two and a half hour for a full charge. Right here, you're looking at a 2.4 inch uh, IPS screen and you got a bunch of buttons. This is the power button. This is where you can uh, capture photos or shoot videos. This is like your control button, uh, a gallery button. So you can store image uh, in this camera. And here is your print button. So you can just instantly print out your photos. So if you look at the side here, this is actually where you charge your camera. It's using a micro USB cable to charge. And there is also a memory card slot that supports up to say 2 gig of storage. And at the front is where your printing magic happens. Right, so here is where you put your thermal roll. So this is a thermal printer, meaning um, you don't need ink. It actually uses heat to produce the image, which also means you will be getting a monochrome color. So it, it's not going to be colorful, it's just black and white. And there are different kinds of thermal rolls. So uh, there are some that are for photos, some are like for stickers, and uh, there are some for labels specifically. So for kids, this camera actually come with a manual. I'm just gonna grab it right here. So it's specifically written, my first camera Insta We manual for kids, but don't worry, adults can read it too. Um, there are a bunch of buttons right here, which uh, the manual will help you know what is what. It will take some time to get used to, but once you're familiar with it, it's easy. And so this camera can shoot up to 12 megapixel resolution. You can go lower, but why would you, right? And it can also shoot video. So to shoot photo, you just click. And to shoot video, you have to hold for it to record. And then it records up to 1080p. So I guess that's good for a camera slash printer that is uh, usable for both kids and adults. All right, so when you buy this camera, you will also get a free lanyard, which is this one. It's yellow, it matches the yellow camera. But I think this is best for kids because this is like the longest length and and it basically just reaches here. And you can tie this. Yeah, so how you do it is you tie it around the ears. I'm, I'm not actually going to tie it right here. But yeah, so basically this is where you can tie it around the camera so you can hang it around your kid's neck so they don't actually drop the camera. Um, and this camera is 232 gram, which is heavier than your average smartphone. So maybe the younger ones like I don't know, a one or two year old will think that this is too heavy for them. Nice. Okay, so let's talk about printing. Like I've mentioned, this is where you put in your thermal paper, thermal roll. So when you print, it will basically come out right here and then you'll just tear it off and you're good to go. So there are a few like this one. It's not a sticker paper, so it's basically just a normal paper. This is our videographer anthem. And then we also have different kind of thermal rolls, right? So for example, this one, which is torn by my videographer bell, it's a sticker kind. So you can actually rip it out and just stick it somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> so if you really want like a photo printer, like a super good quality one, this, this is not it because it's black and white and obviously I, I think you can see it's very grainy but it is very good at printing um, I want to say kids stuff like look these icons um, all these presets drawings you know like the elephant let me show you the elephant so this one is really clear very sharp so these are good but when it comes to printing photos it's 
this is the camera's dock so you just place it right here and this is basically for when you want to print with your smartphone so back here right there's a power button and there's also um, a wi-fi button so you need to switch this on when you click so now it's switched on and then we're gonna press this wi-fi button okay once you hear that sound that's when you connect your phone to the app so I have already downloaded the app on my phone and my phone is currently connected to the Wi-Fi of the camera. So once you go in the app, there are a few options you can pick from. So if you look at template, um, there are uh, different kinds of labels that you can print. There are also presets. So it's basically like frames where you can type in text or do some random drawing for your kids. This is mainly for kids. If you go to the picture one, you can take picture with your phone and print it out using the camera or you can just select uh, photos that you've already taken previously in your smartphone but of course again this will all print out in black and white so there is one thing that i don't really understand you can pick filters for your photos um, in the app itself but it's kind of pointless because whatever filter you pick right it, it comes out as black and white it's just that some filters they kind of um, changes the texture so that will uh, that will show in your photos but if you're talking about color filters there is no point picking them because it'll come up monochrome anyway so okay so before we print there's actually a print preview so you can select a pretty basic settings um, your print density low medium or high and how many copies of the picture or labels that you want so i'm just gonna select high and one copy and we're gonna print now and you just tear it off like this basically if you look at my phone i actually set this uh, they call it the nostalgia filter so that's this sepia sepia effect but once it's printed it's black and white like i've mentioned anyways i do think this filters have their um, other function which is basically if you have photos stored in the memory card of this camera itself you can still apply these filters but you print them out on uh, another printer that actually has color so we tried printing one this is with a bit of a filter so but you can't do that with this camera it's just that you can use the photos in this camera and print it elsewhere so another reason why this camera is for kids is because it comes with all these um, frames and effects that comes readily available in the camera. So you just have to press either of this button and you can switch between effects. There are also timers, a 3 second timer and a 3 second photo burst mode and all these kid friendly effects. So to sum it up, this camera is like a toy camera for a kid but also a label maker for an adult so if you're talking about you know like instax camera those kind of photo quality this is not it this is for like it's like a two-in-one okay for your kid and for you maybe during the daytime your kids wants to um, play with something they like shooting photos you can give them this camera and you know whenever you need to label stuff label your clothes label your kitchen label your food that's when you use this as a label maker for 399 ringgit, I think this is a rather expensive toy camera for your kid or a label maker for yourself. But then again, it does have all these um, different functions all fit into one compact camera that is portable and I want to say durable because this looks like it won't break if you accidentally drop it on the ground. So if you have the extra cash, you can get this. But uh, I just want to let you know that there are many other affordable toy cameras that uh, kids can play with while you can also get the extra cash to get yourself a proper label maker. That's it for our video today. If you have any more questions regarding this My First Camera Insta We, and it's a very long name, Feel free to let us know in the comment section down below and we'll try our best to answer all your questions. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, KLGadget TV, and I will see you in the next one. Kachak, bye.